Hello friends, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back with another delicious pattern Swiss roll recipe. Please keep watch for my easy method with simple ingredients. In a medium size bowl, add an egg with caster sugar. Beat until the egg combined with sugar and turn out to a pale color. Then you can add butter, mix it with the mixture. Then again you can start adding the flour. At last, cocoa powder. Mix well. When the mixture turns soft and creamy, transfer it to a piping bag. And then you can create your own unique Swiss roll art. Take any pattern and trace over it with the parchment paper. Line your baking tray with this parchment paper down and with another layer and another layer on top now you can start pipe over the pattern with your own colored better Now you can let this rest in the fridge until we prepare the Swiss roll better. To prepare the batter, separate the egg white, beat until peak forms. Then set to a side and in a big bowl add the egg yolk, icing sugar and beat these two ingredients until it's become foamy. Then you can add flour little by little. Mix it well and you have to make sure that you should not over beat the mixture once you add the flour and add vanilla and lastly egg whites when you add the egg white you have to make a gentle fold with a spatula when it turns soft and fluffy pour the batter onto the baking pan with the pattern spread the batter evenly with the spatula and gently tap the pan on table two or three times. This will go in the preheated oven over 170 degrees Celsius for about 10 to 14 minutes or until an inserted toothpick to cake comes out clean and then you can remove the cake from the oven now you can flip it over the baking tray on a wire rack or cutting board and then now you can slowly remove the parchment sheet from the cake while hot without removing the pattern
then you can start roll the cake while it's hot and let it cool down until we prepare the filling. Into another big bowl, add all the given filling ingredients. Start beat slow to high speed until the mixture turn very soft and let this mix rest in the refrigerator for some time. As a last step you can take out the chilled rolled Swiss roll and you can spread it then start spread the filling cream evenly then roll it then now you can roll it again and freeze this for few hours or overnight now it's been in the fridge for few hours now I'm going to slice the now I'm going to cut the edges and slice the cake and you can serve with a cup of tea. Hope you like this recipe. Please do give a thumbs up if you like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for your support.